name is Coach Lian from Cruise Control. Uh, this is where all the magic happens. Um, a lot of people have been asking what CRZ has been using, some of them. Uh, so this is one of the examples of a, a made-to-measure titanium bike. Today's episode, we just wanted to, well, we had some requests on how the design happens. So we're just going to give you a really quick insight on, on one of the few steps. First step in the, in the made-to-measure program, uh, let's jumpstart going towards our 3D printing manufacturing. So this is how, it, this is how the program works. First, we develop a model. This is a prototype 3D printed uh, head tube. We decide on the shape. We decide on the bearing standard. We decide on the tube diameter. So all these things create this visual uh, look of the aesthetic of the bike. So it's not just about the function part. We, we also wanted to showcase how the entire package would look like. So that's, that's the first one. So this is the head tube uh, prototype. One of the key features here is that this will be a titanium uh, tube once the production starts. Uh, some of the some of the highlights would be a, a bigger rounded hole for all the cables to come in seamlessly. Uh, the design right now is that full integration, so no more cables inside. I mean, no more cables outside. Everything should be integrated. Uh, the next. Uh, you can say milestone for the next 2023 models for the for the 3D printed uh, titanium bikes is the bottom bracket part. So this is the most important part, but this time we're going to be using a new standard. So this bottom bracket hole is now T47, T47 threaded. So we just thought that putting more threads now in the bottom bracket part will, uh, you know, reduce the creaking that most press fit. Uh, bottom brackets uh, usually suffer on. So T47 for 2023, this is it. If you look at the shape, we try to make it as aesthetically, uh, you can say sexy as possible for, for a titanium bag. So that's one. Next would be the uh, seat tube cluster. So the next iteration compared to uh, our standard bike is we want to reduce or remove the uh, seat clamp module. So everything now will be integrated. One of the things that our mechanic here suggested is that we put the lock underneath here. So that's going to be one of the major, uh, you can say, uh, uh, revisions for tonight that we're going to be doing. So that's it. Now we've decided on using the uh, FSA ACR uh, head tube system. So there's DCR used by DEDA, there's ACR used by FSA. The significance of that is that the bearings that we will be using are a little bit bigger so that uh, we can have more space for the cables to go in. Uh, so it's as simple as this bearing, which is uh, 52 in diameter, just pop them up like this. Yeah, okay, so now we know that there's really a tight fit and the other one. So we just pop them up. We have to make sure that the tolerances and dimensions are exactly how they are before we start uh, manufacturing your custom made, made to measure titanium. Whoop, that's how the tolerance are. That's it. Okay. So there you go. So those are the bottom bracket star. This would now be the cover specific to this diameter. So if you can see the design, it just fits perfectly there. There you go. So in the end, when all this finishes, this is going to be the module. This is going to be the frontal area. You see that sexiness that uh, we're trying to achieve aesthetically aside from the function. And that's it. So hopefully you you enjoy that episode. This one goes straight right in there. So everything should fit like a jigsaw puzzle. Okay. All right. Thank you very much. That's it. And then the end product will be this base.
his wife is calling because she's tracking him. Why aren't you moving? You have to uphold. You have to uphold the bar you set for first place. Come on. I noticed you've stopped way too long. So sometimes the torque for this is five newton meters. You gotta go eight. So it's best if you don't have a, a mobile torque meter with you, that you have a 30 year experience torque wrencher. <laughs> that way uh, you know exactly how many Newton meters you've applied what without the... That, that seat is already taken with a patron sink of Allen wrenches. Mr. Mr. <laughs> well, <I'm laughs> Mr. Barney. <laughs> see, see Barney, even we don't have Allen wrenches all the time, huh? Relax, <laughs> oh, relax. <laughs> Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Thank you, Kev. Thank you, Paul. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, you're in your hand. Yeah. Share your feature with the